Football Friday night kicks off in exactly one week. We'll call tonight a little practice run. Several mid-Missouri schools took part in preseason jamborees this evening. We'll start in Wardsville. Six teams taking part at Blair Oaks, where Terry Walker takes over as the new head coach. Elias also there. Tim Rulo in his first season with the Crusaders. The Capital City rivals went one on one in the final matchup of the evening. Elias Jacob Storms taking that one down the sidelines, runs it in for a touchdown. The Falcons would respond with a touchdown drive of their own against Elias. Jake Van Ronslin dives in for the short score. The other teams in action tonight there, the California Pintos coming off three straight state semifinal appearances. A lot of new faces in California this year, but they've got some big expectations. Landon Mouse used to catch the touchdowns. Now he's throwing them. Sam Cummings on the receiving end here for California into the end zone against the Owensville Dutchman. The Moberly Spartans, they have a new head coach this year. Cody McDowell taking over for Jason Ambrosian, who spent several years at Moberly. Nice pass here. Drake Davidson to John Hyman inside the five yard line. That would lead to a touchdown for the Spartans. The Centralia Panthers, Earl Bennett back in charge. They look sharp tonight. Clayton Marty runs in for a touchdown here. Six teams all looking good tonight in Wardsville. The Hickman Cupy hosted a four team jamboree, welcoming Columbia rivals Battle and Rockbridge. The Camdenton Lakers also taking part in the jamboree. At the home of the Cupies, first series of the night, the Battle Spartans, the defending Class 5 state champions. They move the ball nicely here. Brevin Tyler, the quarterback, takes off down the sideline. He'll go 20 yards for a first down. Spartans not able to push it in. Camdenton pounding the ball with the running game, and then they go to the air here. Dylan Decker finds tight end Parker Stidham for the nice gain and a first down for the Lakers. The Rockbridge Bruins on offense. They look good all night long. Running back Nick Collins takes the handoff. This against the rival Cupies, and he is gone 42 yards to the end zone. That's a Rockbridge touchdown. They had a few of them all on the night. Hickman's defense would calm down, though. Defensive end Brandon Jones gets the sack of Carson Ringdahl here. The three Columbia schools, the public schools battle Rockbridge Hickman. They'll all open up the season next Saturday at Faro Field. No jamboree for the Jays tonight. Ted LePage's team stayed home for their annual red and black scrimmage. The quarterback Gunner C going to the air. Rashawn Woods wide open down the sidelines. He'll take it. 58 yards for a touchdown. Next time, C going long again. Daniel Ellinger on the receiving end. He's in for a Jefferson City offense touchdown. Ted LePage liking that. The Jays will head to St. Louis. They'll play McClure North. That's in the season opener next Friday. Tomorrow night, we'll have coverage from Tolton High as the Trailblazers host a jamboree. Former Missouri Tiger Michael Sam announced on Twitter tonight that he is stepping away from football. Last year, Sam became the first openly gay player taken in the NFL draft. He spent the early part of this season in the Canadian Football League playing for the Montreal Alouettes.